coming down to uh, the branches um, say uh, what all should be considered when you select a branch or uh, now we have uh, new generation branches like btech in ai machine learning etc so um, can you take me through these uh, different branches and and also which is the most popular one yeah <laughs> this is uh, sometimes very confusing choice for both the parents and the students uh, in engineering there are a wide variety of branches so i'll just tell about these uh, branches in brief uh, so there are traditional branches or core branches like civil uh, mechanical and electrical uh, these branches uh, have consistent career options and uh, minimum guaranteed jobs in uh, government and uh, public sector enterprises uh, then there are what are called as uh, circuit branches uh, electrically the oldest of these uh, circuit branches uh, then there is electronics and communication engineering computer science and engineering and information technology uh, then there are uh, very specific branches like chemical uh, then as you said there are new gen branches uh, specialized branches like uh, btech in artificial intelligence btech in uh, artificial intelligence and machine learning nanotechnology or, or even there are now btech in engineering physics so wide variety of branches to choose from so the uh, student has to choose from these branches depending on his flair and interest somebody who is very good in programming uh, they can may uh, try maybe uh, computer science or information technology somebody who is very practical oriented somebody who is interested in construction buildings design they can try uh, maybe civil or architecture so all this depends on the general interest and flair of the student so wide variety of uh, the menu is very large i should say in engineering